Hello, how are you? How are you? I want to say blessed Memorial Day, Memorial Weekend. Always thankful for those who came before us to do the hard work. Let's do smudge. Negativity away. Blessed be. To the betterment of all, to the detriment of none. And for our blessed su subscribers, I got you. Removal of all negativity. Blessed subscribers. We'll let that burn here. Taurus! How are you? I love you guys so much. Taurus, work with me, please. We're going to read these cards together. Correct. Thank you. This is a double deck, in case you're wondering why it is twice as large. It's a double deck. <sighs> Clarifications will be later. But well, first, we're going to have our nine card spread with an energy card. Thank you. Thank you, please. Thank you, please. Taurus, come through. Nine of Cups. Yes, ma'am, Pam. Nine of Cups. Both of you going towards your wish fulfillment. To the world card. New world. A new world opening up to you and this beautiful connection. Something has ended or is in the it is in the last phase and is ending so that a new world can open up. We are going to go to clarifications later. Eight of Pentacles, I love it. This is a worker. This is someone who doesn't expect anything from anyone. They go and make everything that they need. Not waiting, bringing forth their own natural talents. Someone is diligently at work. Why? For your future. Let's do continue. There you are, the Hierophant. Wish fulfillment. My wish fulfillment is to be with my Taurus, with my beloved. In the middle of your reading, Taurus, we have the star. Hopes, wishes, and dreams going towards your wish fulfillment. And, of course, the lovers. We see it's right, the lovers card, Gemini energy, is right beneath the Eight of Pentacles. Why, though? We're going to go into clarifications. I want you to understand, please, I know these are general readings, but the energy that I get is that your person that you are connecting with is someone who has not had an easy life, has had to work for everything that they have and um, is happy to do so they're not someone who waits for um other people to i'm, I'm sorry i'm listening to my spirit guide they, they're not someone who waits for other people to complete the projects they do it themselves why because they want it done right the first time it's not arrogance it's competence and knowing what you can do this is divine ace of pentacles um some readers say the ace of pentacles is very similar to receiving eight um, pennies from heaven in this reading in this energy i'm i'm receiving the energy of fortune the the universe is handing you a fortune but it is not in the material world for those of you who get it you get it for those of you who do not get it i i wish you to um, go deep within and realize um, the someone's calling to your heart. Your fortune is in your heart. We're talking about wish fulfillment, the Hierophant, and Ace of Pentacles. That's a beautiful... So, okay, <laughs> to the star, star card. I love it when this happened. Aquarian energy, Aquarian energy, and the new world opening up. Mm. And then we have the Empress, Lovers. <laughs> Look at this, you guys. The card energy, the energy that is informing this 
reading is represented in the card of I love it, the hanged man. I have seen, I've looked at life from both sides now. I've seen ups and downs and still somehow I look for you, I search for you. This is someone who, um, with that song, I feel, I don't know that song, um, but and that's why someone's going to scream at me about the correct lyrics. Uh, it's not that they're bitter. They just know that, you know, I, I've been through a lot. I've, I've, I don't even want to say kissed a lot of frogs. It's more like I've, I've lit, I've kissed a lot of frogs, butts. you know, it's, it's more like I, I've seen less than auspicious connections in my life. I'm speaking as someone, the energy of your person, your connection. Um, just as someone is, is one of my soulmates is, is it my soulmate? Your soulmate. I'm sorry, I'm listening. My fortune is you, your, your heart. It's my fortune. It's, you're my beloved. Okay. This connection energy is almost too much. It's almost, um, it's taking my breath away. It's taking my words away. Definitely. Let's do go for clarification though. Okay. You and I, let's work through this clarification for beautiful Taurus we do need to understand more about this connection okay I'm receiving messages One more. thank you thank you Christ conscious clarification for Taurus please come through so we have Nine of Cups walking towards, both of you are walking towards Wish Fulfillment. Yeah, page of Cups, I love it. Someone has a very, um, I'm going to say playful, there's a playfulness about this. Even though they're, they're, a, they're diligently at work, they, don't, they keep their eyes on the prize. But still, there's a joie de vie, there's a happiness, there's, um, it's easy to... Um, to tap into that joy in this connection. Oh, for so long, um, this connection has brought forth the almost like a grieving spirit of Eeyore. Like nothing good happens to me. You know, before we are talking about kissing a lot of frogs or, you know, like that. However, now it, it's as if a new world is opening up to them. Love makes everything possible. And there we go, the Hierophant. It's a great balance. It's a great balance of being serious, being dedicated, being devoted, and having this love of life. This part is new for your person. Having a new love for life, having a new respect for love, it's new to them. They're working on their, I see Virgo energy, Oh, the hermit card. They're working on their past. They're working on letting that go so that they can have this new world with you. King of Cups. King of Cups. Yes, look at, I love this, this gold and the, the beautiful blue. Let's do go on. When I'm telling you that they're looking and they're working on a new world, please believe me. They, they also keep an eye out for you. This is not creepy stalker type energy. This is when you are sending unconditional love to your connection, to your beloved, it's as if you want to say your, your health, your, what are you trying to say? I'm listening to my spirit guides. Your welfare is my concern. Okay, your welfare is my concern. They want to hold you. Do you see how the, the universe cups that pentacle lovingly? And that's how they want to kind of just hold you and, 
and keep you safe, keep you surrounded by their love. Let's do go on because they see you as the, the, the beautiful Empress. I see this Hierophant energy, Empress, Empress, Hierophant, Hierophant, star, star. It's, it's really a lot, a lot in this energy. And here we have the Knight of Swords. With that sword comes the air energy and truth. I need to tell you the truth. I'm compelled. I want to come towards you. I need to come towards you and speak to you. I've always been accessible. I've always been watching you, hoping um, that your day is going well, sending you my unconditional love. I'm in the process of working out my past challenges. It's going to be a time of celebration. I see three of cups. I see a community celebration, perhaps a wedding, because they are going to take this leap of faith. They are going to take this leap of faith. I want another, because you are the soulmates. Because you are the soulmates. I'm going to utilize this. Taurus, do you see it? Do you see it? I mean, <clears throat> You're here, so you understand tarot. You're, you're, the beauty of it is these energies are coming through. No matter what we do, I don't want to say no matter what we do. I want to say no matter what happens in life, it's proceeding. It's advancing. It might not feel that way, but life is working towards your favor. Wish fulfillment. I don't want to overrake the pudding. Um, the Hierophant, Katie Bug, the Hierophant, that's how, it, that's you, and that's your, this connection, stepping into your power, never to be relinquished again. Um, I do feel like both of you are going to have an endeavor that is of help to humanity, helper agents. Ten of Cups, the happy family, protected, a shield of love, protected by a shield of love because the wish fulfillment is coming through these double cards. Wish fulfillment, you're both coming towards each other. Okay, thank you very much. I love it. The tower event. A tower event has occurred. Why am I thankful? Because sometimes we need that tower event to move those things that have been in our life that have not been useful away. Make straight this path so that the two soulmates can come towards each other. What does that mean? What could be um, deleterious in the presence of this connection? Uh, negative energy. That's why I'm compelled to smudge so frequently lately, especially for you, Taurus, and our dear subscribers, especially for you to clear away these negative thoughts from other people who really should um, stick to their own foibles. Uh, it's easier for them to point and, and mock this true love or, or to get in the way, become an impediment because they can't match this energy. We'll forgive them for being jelly because um, who wouldn't be? Quite frankly, who wouldn't be? The star Aquarian card. You are my hopes, wishes, and dreams. What? You are my hopes, wishes, and dreams. It's taken a lot. It's taken a lot of patience, temperance. Being made strong through this patience. Being made strong. If this connection can even be any stronger, it is going to be. And fairness. Thank you. Six of Pentacles. Parity given an equal attention to all things. Sometimes I say atten fair attention and affection, but I'm seeing here 3D and 5D. Um, this connection has lived great amount of this with great energy in 5D. Sorry, sometimes my spirit guys almost like Yoda, they do speak. But this is more like 3D and 5D. What you've enjoyed in 5D with your connection is now going to come through in 3D as you come together. More, please. Ah, and how frequently now, Taurus, 
has the Four of Swords followed the Six of Pentacles. And how brilliant that is. Why? Because it takes a lot of energy to withstand this pure love energy. Let's do clarify the lovers. Again, King of Cups. The greatest regal, royal, beautiful love. I don't even want to cover this up. How can I do this? How can I do this? Move it over. Thank you. You guys are brilliant. Thank you. King of Cups, more. Nine of Pentacles, the card of increased energy. Pre-Empress energy, Nine of Pentacles. They see you as gorgeous. My gorgeous, gorgeous Taurus. Yes, and then we have the Knight of Cups still on their way. I know, we can... We can Point at the Knight of Cups and say, you're not in, you're not in a hurry. Haste, haste, make haste, but they do not. However, they also do not fall off their horse and they do not get lost. So we're thankful for that. <coughs> Taurus, you might be, have a connection with another Taurus. I, I get this um, throat chakra. Ace of Pentacles clarified by Ace of, of Wands. Beautiful. I will show you the way. This fire energy it being lit like a torch. Someone's carrying a torch for you and it is right, well, and good. Justice card, Libra energy. And I've made this investment. <coughs> I'm so sorry. I've made this investment. I've been working diligently toward this connection. Because you are my hopes, wishes, and dreams, my star judgment. This is a second part of my life. This person might be, and you might be, um, in the age range of 40-ish, 50-ish, or 60-ish even. I, I see that it, it's as if life has given you, the divine has given you, a uh, new, it's, it's like everything is brand new. God bless you. You make me feel brand new. Judgment. Second chances. <clears throat> I'm going to have to take something to drink. Sorry. Wow. This energy is. Phenomenal. Sorry about that. So I tell you that this might be a second chapter in someone's life, um, a second chance at love. King of Pentacles in reverse. Why that though? Why that? Why that? Why in reverse? Someone might be feeling, and this could be a feeling more than an actuality. Do you get me? Someone might be feeling as if their life is being turned upside down. They could be experiencing some um, financial challenges. <clears throat> I'm so sorry. Financial challenges. Um, I don't see a great worry with finances, but it's just a challenge. Uh, they want to keep on working so that they present to you their empress as all together there and ready. Uh, they, just, they want to present to you as perfectly done. So they are feeling, and this could be some of the reason for the um, slowdown in this connection. King of Pentacles in reverse. They want to, they, it's, could it be that it's mostly in their mind that they're feeling um, it's, it's, a, it's as if they want to show up and like, here's the ring, here's the home, <laughs> here I am. They want to present everything, which would be almost to you overwhelming. Please, one more card. Okay. Ace of Cups, another ace. When I tell you that this... This connection is divinely crafted, divinely created, divinely guided. It's as if someone 
or spirit on the other side. Spirit is conversing with your connection, saying, you must not be in this. It's almost like they're throwing themselves into the gym. They're working um, two or three jobs. They are overextending themselves so that they can approach the Empress in a almost like a perfect manner. But no matter what, no matter what, even if you were um, not prepared, oh, to connection, this is the connection of Taurus. Even if you were not prepared, Taurus is ready to receive you. They are ready for you. Okay, so let's be quite succinct about this. Taurus, you are watching your tarot. Here is your person working hard, thinking that they don't match up to your standards as an empress. It's not that you would reject them. It's not that you would look at them, you know, look down at them. But they want to present as the Hierophant. That's not easy, is it? So they see you as the Empress. It's taken a lot of strength, that Leo energy. And then the truth, the truthiness of it all. Queen of Swords. The truth is going to set them free. Okay, so this person has been, Taurus, the person you're thinking of has been in progress for some time. But remember, uh, perhaps even two months ago, we were calling, saying, I feel their Eeyore energy. No longer are they Eeyore energy. However, they are still letting go of old ideas that make them feel less than right that make them feel less than it's taken a lot of patience from you correct it's taken a lot of patience one more card please and you will know the truth because it's coming through in eight of wands it's coming through in communication i will say that your person has nothing to hide from you they're almost like, here are my cards. I'm laying all my cards out in front of you so you can see absolutely everything. There's nothing to hide. Let's ask for some messages, though. Don't forget, the card energy that is informing this whole reading is the hanged man. Your person, your connection, Taurus, has been through a lot. And they, it's taken them a while. I want to give them so much credit, though, for not continuing with the energy of Eeyore. They are now working on their joie de vie. They're working on increasing their energy. We have two times the Nine of Pentacles next to the Lovers. I love it. Yeah. The, the other thing, Taurus, I, I really need you to understand is they see you as, um, as the Empress. So you're awe-inspiring. They're a bit nervous to approach you, but they are going to take that leap of faith. Okay, let's do get into some of these messages, if we could, please. Please help us with some of these messages. Please help us. Taurus and their connection. And God bless the connection. This person who has been working on their... Okay, I hear the word attitude. That doesn't really suffice for it. It's not an attitude, but it's it's more like their idea of themselves. They are working on their idea of themselves. Taurus, this is not you. This is your connection I'm talking about. And mind, body, Christ consciousness. Please help us with communication messages. New love. A new person has stirred your romantic feelings. It is a new person. They have recreated themselves. A new world, a new love. They have recreated themselves as the king of cups. Oh, you come back here. There you go. Not an easy feat, is it? Express your love. Go ahead and make the romantic gesture. When I tell you that you are their hopes, wishes, and dreams, please believe so. 
retreat. It's time to disconnect from the world. Having that time together, taking that maybe even um, honeymoon or just, you know, this is going to be our time to discover each other. Protect this, you know, just like the, the Ten of Cups protects that new family from any kind of negativity. Protect this love from negativity. Stay, okay, there you go. Stay optimistic about your love life. Positive thinking and faith will bring you romance, hopes, wishes, and dreams. Give your relationship a chance. Work on your partnership. When I tell you Eight of Pentacles, they have been diligently at work. Please believe me. Past life relationship, our Six of Cups. You have known each other before. You have known each other before. When you are connected, when you are together, finally, holding each other in, in each, you're just holding each other. And it's as if you can complete each other's thoughts and sentences. When? Very soon. Clearly decide what you want so that it comes to you. When? Now. Emotion in motion. Wedding. Here we go. Three of Cups. Community celebration. This situation involves marriage. Now everyone has a different idea of marriage. It must not be the traditional idea of marriage, but it very well could be because this is your soulmate. Yes. 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 This is your soulmate. I wish I could hand this to you through the computer screen. This is your soulmate, your beloved. I'm going to take a chance. I have a bit of more energy to express here for you, with you, Taurus. For those of you who um, are leaving us now, please have a great day. Um, keep those who have given up the ultimate sacrifice in service and memorial weekend in our hearts and prayers. Taurus connection. It's overwhelming. When I tell you this energy is overwhelming, that's why I can do <laughs> one or probably two at tops readings a day. And sometimes I need to take a, a time off in between. <sighs> Messages for Taurus, please. In this connection, Christ consciousness, mind, body, spirit. Please come through. I miss you. No matter what looks on the outside, I have become good at hiding my true feelings. I what? Miss you. I miss you. I have to be near you. You bring out the best in me. I'm a better partner because of you. I want to cherish you forever. My Empress, my love, my beloved. I can't stand the thought of you being with someone else. I'm jealous. Have I lost you forever? This is where they're, these old past relationships, um, the energy once in a while creeps into their presence and they are a work in progress because they are realizing this is a brand new love. This is a brand new love. You're the love of my life. Taurus, you are the love of my life. You want me to be a, you want, I can't even, this is so strong. You make me want to be a better person. I want to be happy and content with you. Ten of Cups. I can, one more card, you guys. I can't admit that I'm wrong. My ego comes between us. I hide my insecurity behind my foolish pride. This is, you know, remember talking to you, they have things that they are moving out of their, um, again, they used to be that your energy no longer. They are moving away from it, but it takes so, some time. When it's true and real, it takes time. It's an evolution. When it's false and just a pretense, you know, anyone, they can like, Pretend like it's there. That's not your person. Your person works for what they want and need. They don't expect it to happen overnight. No one loves me like you do. I'm ready to commit to you and our beautiful future. There. There. 
There you go. Taurus, God bless our subscribers. Please take good care of yourselves. Give yourself a break when you feel like this is a, a almost overwhelming. Because even as a reader, I'm able to feel how strong this love, adoration, commitment is. It's overwhelming. It's a work in progress. Thank you for allowing me to be a part of this connection. I'm honored. Take good care of yourselves. Okay, bye-bye now.